Good evening all, or hello for the guys that's not in South Africa, where it's a different time zone. Um, welcome back to my channel and for the second video of my Z-Scale Briefcase Layout build. Um, yeah, I'm starting to get quite excited with the build. I'm really enjoying it and um, I'm very excited to see the, the progress and um, work, work on that. So I bought two sheets of styrofoam. The base layer is just the base and the second one um, I've cut out where the track will go and I've lift up, lifted up the sections where the track will cross, um, cross each other. So that's all done now. Um, then um, I've um, painted the styrofoam where the track is going to lay so that it's um, brown underneath the track and not the white styrofoam. Um, so that's also done and then I've glued down the track um, and done endless of testing. So I know that locomotives from um, a BR89, which is my smallest one, and the BR80 that I've also got until the big um, DB01 locomotives, they will all run without hesitation. Then I've also tested my rail bus and I've tested two or three um, um, diesel locomotives. So to make, and in obviously in all directions to make sure that the track is um, nicely laid and the trains doesn't have a problem with, with um, going up the inclines and um, pulling power and that kind of thing. So I've also pulled some um, wagons. Um, obviously it's a small layout, so long passenger coaches is not going to work here. So it's not the idea to, to run that kind of thing. And it's also not the idea to run uh, a DB or a BR01. Um, it's purely for the smaller, smaller locomotives, rail bus, diesels, um, small steam engines, those kind of things. No electric, electric trains. Um, so it's purely steam and diesel. Um, so yeah, I think I'll keep quiet now and, um, I'll um, carry on with the video and you guys can um, enjoy and um, yeah, please ask questions if there's any and I'm always willing to help and to explain more on how I do things. Um, and also please like and subscribe at the bottom. Um, it always helps and it's, if you guys comment it shows me that um, there's some interest and it yeah, I can tell you guys how I do things and if you, if you want to know. So yeah, let's get on with the video and thank you very much and we'll speak again soon. Bye. 